Hey guys, welcome back. So we've got another uh, exciting beard product review for you just to let you know pros and cons about it. Yeah. Today I wanted to talk about the Honest Amish Beard Balm. Um, I actually really like this stuff. It, it's, uh, Jen, Jen, it's good. There's, there's some pros and cons yeah, to yeah, it. Yeah, but, you, but you go first. My, I, again, smells great. Um, Very manly. The thing I really like about it, easy to apply. It doesn't take much work to, to get it into your beard. Uh, my beard feels awesome afterwards and it lasts all day really well. Like I'm, I'm impressed with how well, well it lasts, right? It does, it does. The one con I have is it makes your beard look a little, a little too glossy for me. It does. It's, it's, it's almost like oily. got some yep. glitter in it, you yep. know, like if I want to go down to the club and show off my bling in my beard. That doesn't ever happen. I never go to the club, so. In terms of, it, it is a little bit more on the waxy side, but it's nice because it's a, it's a little bit between like a lotion, like a very thick, thick, thick lotion and a wax. So in terms of having to work it up, I mean, you can like stick your finger in it and work it. Some of these you really got to scrape and warm oh, you, up. You must have a different kind than me then. Yeah. Now, that's a good thing to note. A lot of these, especially Honest Amish, this is actually created by Amish folk in Pennsylvania, where I grew up. Now, because each batch is made by hand, the product varies in terms of its consistency. Yes. So the batch that I got, it takes a little bit more work because it is a natural, totally natural product. Now, the one that Micah got here, right? Give him a shot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so, so it's a little bit more liquidy, so it doesn't take as much work. It doesn't take like and any that work, so is, that's interesting. And I found that to be the nature with a lot of these different beard products, especially when they're made with 100% natural ingredients. They don't have a lot of the preservatives or things that make a lot of like traditional like dial or like um, you know soaps you get at Target or Walmart. They have all those preservatives that make them super consistent 100% of the time. These. Or not that way. So it's got virgin shea butter, cocoa butter. I mean, good stuff. I spread so it. I, I spread it you. on my toast and eat it. It's delicious. Uh, sometimes I just shove my beard in my mouth, suck cinnamon. on it for just a bit. Suck on it. Yeah, if you yeah like if you're snack. if you're stuck somewhere, your car breaks down, you have nothing to eat for days. <laughs> eat your beard. I mean, that's that's what it is. It flavors your beard that's, to that's keep all you alive. Beard is for. Right? It's survival. Survival yes. of the fittest and Amish. Honest Amish takes the cake, yeah. you know what I'm saying? So in terms of total conditioning, um, it does great. I, I like using this one at night as like an overnight yes. treatment. So That's if your beard's point. really suffering, put it on right before you go to bed and then put your hair dryer on a medium setting if you have a hair dryer. I know it sounds kind of womanly, but get over it. You need to open up the follicles in your hair to allow the product to get in and really do its work. No. That's all it's about. I, I think that's really fair. I actually didn't, I didn't like the hair dryer style. I mean, it's not for everybody. Yeah, it's personal but, preference. But, it's but, really worked for me. But for me, like, I, I agree. I did it at night. I just would pack this stuff on at night when my beard was just nasty. Like, it was, like, brittle. I could, like, break. It was break. It dry. It was it's nasty. Like taking a break from, you know, using, using products. Yeah, I, I, I uh, you know, I, I, I went I to rehab. <laughs> I went to product rehab. Yeah, I didn't, I mean, obviously I've slipped, but it's okay. It's yeah, been, it's okay. been... It's been maybe so, 12 hours. Well, and I felt the before and after. I mean, you had me come right. in, I felt it, and I was like, I It, it feels something. like garbage. Like. And you did, and then it was surprising. But it wasn't like, doing two weeks later, it was yes. significantly And better. I did it, I actually, the first while, for the first five days, I did it every night to really get it worked in. And now I do it about once a week, and it really helps. I love it at night. It's great, like it's, right before bed. And also, it helps your beard not be, have. What, instead of bed head, you have beard head? Bad beard. Bed beard. Bed beard. <laughs> bed beard and beyond. Yep. Anyways, guys, um, check it out. Remember, it's uh, Honest Amish. It's going to be their heavy duty beard balm or their regular beard balm, whatever you can find. It's available on Amazon. But as always, let us know how you feel about this stuff. If you've given it a try or if you found something you really like, let us know. And as always, save the beard. Save it.